Hi, I'm Troy Calder with, with XCOM Systems. I'm here to talk about uh, the capture playback system with uh, the Tektronix RSA as our front end. So what we have here is a spectrum analyzer that we're using as our front end digitizer. It takes um, the RF signal and down converts 110 megahertz worth of bandwidth and outputs a digital stream of I and Q to our capture box. So we capture up to 600 megabytes per second. And then we have several tools in software where we can sift through that mass amount of information. Our storage capabilities are up to 32 terabytes worth of data, which is around 10 hours worth of capture at 110 megahertz. So what we're going to do now is do a capture on this. So um, it's a very simple product. We have done a lot of work to make sure that it's easy to use. We have these big, nice block buttons that tell you capture and playback. So what we're going to do right now is just do a capture. So we'll, on the software, we'll click on capture data. When I click on capture data, it brings up the capture screen. I can type in some sort of descriptive text so that I can identify it at a later time. So we're going to type in test. You know, that's really descriptive. And it builds the file name below. And we're at 110 megahertz. We're going to do a timed capture. So we're going to do, say, 10 seconds. And now all we need to do for the capture is just hit the Start button. So right now we're hitting the Start button. And it's going to be capturing uh, the waveform over here on the Tektronix box is uh, a bunch of Wi-Fi coming here from the building. We have three different stations that we're tracking here. And occasionally you'll see Wi-Fi pop up, search for a signal, and lock onto something. So uh, our capture is completed, and uh, we hit done. We now can click on playback and regenerate that RF, or we can take it into our software and do some analysis on it. So if we look up on the other screen, I don't know if you can see that in the picture, we actually have the same capture here, and we'll start to play through it. Well, you can see it's building a very similar picture to what you see on the RSA, but this is in stored data. So we can search on captures uh, for all different types of information on carriers, or we can do a correlation function to find specific signals that we're looking for. Is that good?